Where? Hello, and welcome to Ghost Theory. In this episode, we visit two of the most haunted churches in the UK. Was that all right? Do you think maybe I should tone it down a little bit? That was that was pretty good. I like that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it's too much. Fine, whatever. Hello, welcome to Ghost Theory. In this episode, we go to two churches. They're abandoned, obviously, because they haven't got any roofs. Uh, we do a bit of ghost hunting. Uh, some stuff happens. We then we went home. Hope you enjoy it. Hello, and we're here today. Welcome to Ghost Theory. Hi. Oh, crap. Where? This isn't good. There's a man. This is not good. What is the man doing? <laughs> oh, he's What's closed he his blinds. Let's move. Uh, no, no, Joe. Joe, I can't do this. <laughs> you need to come back. Can you open the boot? Thank you. Oh, that is actually... Now you can see now it's ghost theory. Yeah, yeah. Now you know what I mean. Yeah. This is Petworth Chapel. Yeah, I know. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't think you knew. These are gravestones. This is part one of two places tonight's investigation that we're going to do in tonight's investigation. It is. <laughs> As you can tell, they have done a very good job at sealing this up. Um, just good. We are two paranormal investigators, and we have come to Petworth Chapel to see if we can communicate with any spirits. If there are any spirits in here, or any people at all who would like to communicate with us, we would love it if you come forward and let yourself be known. Cat ball going off right behind you. So that was weak. I was about to say it sounded like someone just yeah, I walked just heard behind that. me. Thank you. If that was you, could you move it again? Or can you make the other one flash? Couple. I heard that too. Yeah. Again. I, heard I it, actually heard I it. I heard it move. That was outside. That was in the corner here, yeah. Yeah. That was loud. What is that? Is someone walking out there? Yeah, hang on, be quiet, sir. What on earth? Yeah, that was someone walking out there. That was footsteps. It wasn't though. Because I couldn't see anybody. I heard, I heard footsteps. Yeah, there, but there up. was no person. I was looking at the footpath. Should we have a look deeper into the, the... Oh, yeah. ...the gravy yard? <clears throat> Ooh. It's 
lot bigger than I thought it was, actually. Oh, yeah, it goes quite far down, doesn't it? Wow. OK. <laughs> what was that noise, Dot Com? What did you hear? Well, I literally said, what was that noise? So it's unlikely that I know what it was. Do you know what? I don't know if my camera's going to pick any of this up. No, it is, they do look quite heavy. Oh, nice cobweb there. You can hear lots of things walking around. Mm. Like just over there. Yeah. Is anyone here with us now? Can you walk towards us? I mean, this, it just sounds to me like lots of wildlife here. It's mm. definitely not what I heard up the top. No, but if you listen, you can hear a lot of what sounds like walking right close to us. Can you not hear that? That over there sounded like real walking, not yeah. animals crawling about. Hello? Is that someone there that can come up and say hello to us? That's big. That's massive. I don't like that. Is that deer or something? It's not deer. Deer is silent. Like, I could feel the, the ground, Thumped. like, bassy noise. Yeah. And that was when I called out. Can you come and walk up to us? Is that a spirit out there somewhere? Or is it a human pretending to be one to try and scare us off? Is it a human pretending to be a spirit or a spirit pretending to be human? <laughs> yeah. We're not going to harm you if you come up to us. I wish I had my EVP recording that. If we heard it, will these cameras pick that up? Mm. That will pick that up easy. It's so silent out here too. Mind you, that was right in the grave with us. Yeah. There's not going to be like animals, like cows and that running around here. Or horses. It's just bizarre because that's very similar to the sound that was walking past the church, the yeah. chapel. And I could see the path and see nothing walking on it. And I said that it walked this direction, and now there is 100% something over there. It makes me wonder if we should just walk over there. Should we just go have a look? I think you're... If you're anything makes to... any noises. So I'll take the K2. <clears throat> Is that 
Can you see any, like, signs of animals either? No, just a footpath. That was really, really clear. Like, even I can't make that noise on this ground. Yeah. There's proper thuds. Yeah. Which does make me, again, think it's more of an animal, but... It's, it's just over there. I can still hear it. The thing is, if it's an animal, then... It sounded big. You would have thought you would have seen it. You're like a ghostbuster there. I am. That's what? connected to my womb. Now, coming from you, the more rational one, so to speak, hmm. please explain what you just heard and how annoying it is that we didn't capture it. A child screaming or hmm. a girl screaming. Either someone with a squeaky voice screaming. Swear to God. Swear to God we just heard hmm. that and we're going to now investigate it. I mean, there is a chance there could just be people... Yeah, well, Already that's the thing. There, Are there kids messing around? That's what yep. I want to know. One o'clock in the morning. Now, this place has got, like, every single story you can think of, it's, it's here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, any haunting, any creepy thing you could ever imagine, but quite a lot of the time... Oh, wow, it's literally just straight there as well. I wasn't expecting it to be that quick. Oh. Wow. There it is. It's, uh... Joe, it's in front of you. Where? So where the hell... That screaming, then? Yeah, it was, like, right here. Yeah. <laughs> wow, OK. I was going to say, do you think, like, stories that come from these sort of places, usually there's, there's more of them because they're so accessible? Yes. Because, obviously, anybody can come here. It makes it so, like, anybody can witness anything. Yeah. And, therefore, the stories get around a bit more. Oh, uh, we've got to keep out... Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Yeah, really. <laughs> it's brilliant. <laughs> yeah. All right, OK. Oh. So you can just sort of walk out. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, you can walk out. Well, it's not particularly, like, sealed off or anything, is it? They haven't particularly tried very hard to stop people from getting in. No. <laughs> I can't say this is the hardest access to a building we've ever had. Oh, they've got danger keep out when you're already in here. Like, surely somebody had to come in here to put that sign up. So it can't be that dangerous, can it? <laughs> for the worship of Almighty God, in gratitude for many blessings, this building was erected by W.M. Townley Mitford of Pitchill, Anno Domini, 1880. 1880? This 1880's not actually that long ago. No. It's 142 years old. A lot older than this. Like, I know people older than this. Yeah. Of all the places we've been, yeah. this is the one, I would say, with the most ghost stories. Yes. This, this is, is full of them. Not necessarily the most interesting to look at, but yeah. if we're ever going to find something haunted yeah. or at least debunk stories that ever existed, this is going to be a good place to start. So this is the mystery of the missing file 13. You can see here 30 minutes of my footage from the investigation in and around the church. Now, my camera, for some reason, has lost all the audio in this section, and I'm playing it here just so you can see that we did do it. But during this entire 30 minutes, Elliot was recording file 13, but we've come back, and that file has completely disappeared. So you've seen file 12, and next up will be file 14, so we know he recorded it, but it's just not there, and happens to be at the same time where my camera loses all audio. Please come and join us in the church if you're here. What was that? That was weird. It sounded like a breath. Or was it just you? I was holding my breath.
That joke sounds like something is walking right outside the doors now. Why is it so quiet? No. It wasn't this quiet a minute ago. Catball. Where? Nearly fucking in tears from that. Catball? Where? Oh. They were there before, weren't they? There's bricks everywhere. Well, it's freshly broken because it's different colour. Yes, look. <laughs> That's just hit the wall where we stood. Right. If that happened, if that happens, hang on, no. Joe, that sounded to me like that came from up there. It did, it so, had to have done. So where... I was just going to say... Where does if, a brick come from up there? I was just going to say that if that happens regularly, there'd be lots of that around. But that is part of the building. Yeah. That's not it's a... the same stone. It's not a sort of... Or is it? Is there another building up there? There can't be, that's the foot... Why that's would it the be road. up there? Yeah. Is there any other of that... Is there any other of those sort of stones? What's on the top of that hill? The road. Oh, that's weird. That gives me the creeps. Yes. Yeah, you're telling me I was nearly in tears after that. Like, I had a massive shiver go through my body and that shot. Did you hear the birds go on and yeah. everything? I was going to say, that is... The birds themselves make complete proof that that really happened. Yeah. Yeah, well, that and we were both on camera. Well, yeah, but I mean, you know, we, we can't pay the birds to fly away. <laughs> what? OK, wow. I swear one of the things we asked for was to make something be thrown at us too. And that was like... Yeah, that was massive, though. That was huge. Like, pushed down the hill at us. That was not an animal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. I'm literally, like... That bang really, yeah, really, like, the hit. shook through me. Like, I've never been almost shaken like that. I thought something yeah. was running down the hill towards us and then just, like, flung itself into the wall. That's what I thought. I, that the first thought in my mind wasn't a rock, especially not yeah, a rock no. that's come from the building itself. But why would it? When we walked well, how around... How did the rock get up there? When we and walked around how... the building, we're going to have to... Like, earlier on, we must have recorded to see if... Well, we know that wasn't there, because it's actually... You can see where it's damaged the building. Well, that's exactly where it hit, as, a, yeah. as in the noise from that brick came from this area yeah. as well. And that's exactly where it hit. Pretty much exactly the other side of where I was stood. Is this now a good time? Because I know that people will be shouting at us to go back in that church, shut up, and ask for it to do something again. It's this, isn't it? It's this type of stuff. Yeah. Which is like the foundation is made of that. Okay. 
That's gonna be, that makes it even weirder. I know. Because if it's rock from the cliffside, <sighs> like chalk or something, that makes it more plausible that it's just fallen off of a rock up there. You just knocked the cat ball, right? Not... Mm, not backwards. We can't rule that we, out. Yeah. We can't rule that out. Um, thank you if that was you. I, we did ask you earlier to throw something. <laughs> mm. Can you throw something again? Without killing us. Because that would have bloody hurt if that hit us. That's what I'm worried about. Imagine if we were walking around there at that time. Let's take this... Not if, yeah. Broken a, a rock into three pieces and chipped bricks. Do you just... Do you just think it could have been somebody put out there once? And why is that now going off all of a sudden? And the noises. That was a script a shout. That was. And I just heard something over there. Okay, this is great if this is someone else here messing with us. Can you just carry on? Keep making that ball flash. Would be great if you could throw some more stuff. Brilliant. That's amazing. That wasn't going off for ages. No. If that's someone just by the doorway, can you stop the flashing if you want us to leave? Stop it now. <laughs> oh, that was weird. Start then stop so quickly. Stop it entirely if you want us to go. Like now. So you want us to stay. Okay, stop making it flash if you want us to stay. No intelligent answers, then. It's weird how it does that. Yeah, I know. Why do they do that? Especially it's... weird that that's the one that I thought was flashing. That's what I was going to say a minute ago. Before that happened, I, I thought I saw a flash. Yeah. Which is why I said it. I saw it at the corner of my eye. And it's weird, because earlier you said you thought you saw a flash. Yeah, but I thought I saw a flash through that way. And I also said I thought I saw red through that way. Which is weird. Do you, know, do you feel like it's just all of a sudden gone? It's gone really quiet. Sorry, and also the balls are not flashing. My light was just having a bit of a funny. I keep hearing what sounds like a bloody baby crying. I see. It's probably a tree. And just again, for context, it is two o'clock in the morning. We genuinely do this at midnight, just in case anybody was thinking we fake the time that we do this. It's actually two o'clock, really? It is two o'clock in the morning, yes. I think we might do an all night at this time. <laughs> okay. Go for it. Make some sounds. We put something outside where the brick was thrown. Can you set it off? Just walk towards it, push it over. It's yours to do with as you please.
I feel like it's completely dead. Now. I'm I, almost bored at this point of my. I think. To be fair. Okay, so let's do let's do a sum up conclusion. Haunted or not? Not that we can completely. Um, I think it has its moments, but I don't feel that it's. A lot of this stuff can be explained by animals, but I do feel like there is an element of uncertainty about it. Hmm. I feel that it's not 100% active most of the time, but I do feel like maybe there is something to some of the stories. I'm 100% on the side of this is nothing paranormal, but that's my view. You know what I'm like. I have to be convinced heavily. I'm going, no, I'm not convinced. I'm not convinced either. So. But I. I'm, I'm more than happy to come back and try yeah, again. Yeah, uh, but I do find it interesting and I can see I can, where the stories yeah. come from. I can see why people think it's haunted, but I personally, from everything that, this is the thing as well, now we have much more context. Yeah. But we've seen so many bizarre yeah. things. We've had what seemed like actual conversations with spirits yeah. before. Mm. This just is on a, yeah. it's just not there for me. And on that bombshell, black screen. <laughs>